My name is Tony Wa. I'm an Enos Project Consultant. Uh, just like to share a few of my benefits with uh, managing patients that have had surgery and have potential problems with their lungs, especially in light of this uh, coronavirus uh, infection or shall I say pandemic, um, has one of the major effects is it producing a lot of secretions in the respiratory tract. And these secretions go down to particularly clog up the lungs, making it very difficult for uh, affected patients to breathe. And the advice I give is just something that will help those that are in an environment where they do not have ready access to a respiratory physician. The first of the exercises is based on inspiratory spirometry, whereby we actually ask patients to take a deep breath and breathe out quickly into a device 10 times every hour. We can mimic this by just simply taking a deep breath in and then expiring very quickly so that to try and get the lungs to move mobily and push out the secretions that's there. And I'll demonstrate. And that's just to try and get things moving. Another exercise would be to breathe in about five times deeply and to breathe out. And on the fifth part of the cycle, to cough. And that's just to try and encourage the expiration of the secretions in the respiratory tract. And I'll demonstrate. Remember to cough into your elbow. Another exercise you can do is just with someone where you're just lean forwards and get someone to tap gently on your back all the way through the back and just try to move things around. Another thing that you find helpful is actually breathing uh, on your chest and your tummy to encourage things to move out because lying on your back on its own may well encourage the secretions to stay put. I wish you all the very best and hopefully these exercises will prove helpful to those who are in an environment where we do not have ready access to a respiratory physiotherapist.